think I found what you wanted me to see. Sounds like you did. We'll be waiting. this. I think it's sealed. My friend, it appears the Cepho had some interest in death up here. It's strange. For such a peaceful culture to have any sort of fascination with a place so dark. BD1.
Don't fall behind, BD1. Nice job. My friend. Entering the vault gave me a premonition just as it did for the Zephyr. Should be a lot quicker than the way in. Did I use this place to study the sphere above? I can still feel the excitement.
Oh, hi there. Moving out. Did you want? You passed the test. So you knew about BD1? <laughs> Come on board. We'll talk inside. Oh, BD1, this is Grease. Hey, Grease. What is that? <laughs> get off my sofa! Get, get off my sofa! No! Get out of there! Get out! That is BD1. He's with us. I don't care who he's with. Do you have any idea how hard it is to get oil stains out of petroleum weed fabric? Not really. Oh, I hope you found something better out there than this droid. Oh, calm down, Grease. He did. Tell us, Cal. The vault was built by an ancient civilization called the Zepho. A Jedi named Eno Cordova hid something inside of it. What did he hide inside? A holocron from the archives. Contains a list of four sensitive children. The next generation of Jedi. I knew it! Ah, oh, Cordova, you old fool. You knew him? Yes. A long time ago. I was his apprentice. Cordova was a loner. And that little droid and I are probably the only ones that know about Pagano. Hold on, wait a minute, wait a minute. A holo what? A holocron. It stores information, but only accessible to Jedi. Hang on, I think I have one around here. Use the Force. This is Master Obi-Wan Kenobi. I regret to report that both our Jedi Order and the Republic have fallen. With that list of Force sensitives, we could rebuild the Jedi Order and defeat the Empire. Okay, no problem. Let's get it! Well, except the holocron is hidden deep inside the vault, and to get it, we have to follow Cordova's path. He mentioned something about the planet Dathomir and a Zeppo homeworld. All right, well, where are we going? I'm just asking, because I was thinking of maybe making some food. Look, before we do anything, I need to know something. How come you're no longer a Jedi? I had an experience that changed my perspective. So I... Cut myself off from the Force. But you still want to rebuild the Order. I believe that rebuilding the Order is the best chance we have against the Empire. What do you believe? I believe I can't keep hiding from the Empire, so I don't really have a choice. Cal, as long as you're alive, you will always have a choice. 
Are you with us? We're in. Dathomir is Zepho. It's your choice. I wonder where we should go next. Yeah, maybe there. Must be hard watching all your friends get gunned down. I mean, you know, purged or whatever. What? It helps to talk about it, right? No? Yes, it was difficult. But you must hope, not forget. We must remember the mistakes of the past and change things going forward to make sure they never happen again. Sounds like you're not too sure everything is going to work out. I'm not. That's why adaptation is important. Whether it's a course of action or an idea. We all have to be ready to change. Time to land. Get up here. Think of a storm brewing down there. This might not be the best time to land. Eh, something strange. Those winds are interfering with our comms. Hey, Cordova mentioned something about peace in the eye of the storm. Well, I can just make out a settlement in the middle of it. Then we have to get there. Copy that. Oh. Couple bumps ain't gonna kill you, kid. <laughs> Unless the wind picks up. Can you tell that bucket of balls to keep his opinion to himself? I'm sure everything's under control. Because it's under control, it's just a little tricky. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh. Huh. Perfect landing. Crazy money, baby. Uh, but I'm still getting a lot of interference on the comms. It's gonna take me a minute to get them back up. I'll search for signs of Cordova in the meantime. Good. I'll be in touch once I crack this. Cal, over here. Good work. Oh, we did it. We did it. I hope you're not hurt. What are you looking at? Who are you talking to? Uh, just my ship. The Manus. Good name, right? Intimidating. Oh, what do you know? You've probably never even flown a ship. Maybe I'll teach you one day, when you're done with your Jedi stuff. I'll even give you a discount. Hey, now. Did you find something, BD-1? Can't open it. Hey, BD-1.
Moving out. Watch out, BD. Don't look friendly. What's this? Cal, can you hear me? The Empire. They found Zeppo. If they were following the Mantis, we would have been swarmed already. Could they be looking for the tombs? Let's hope not. Just got our comms working. I'll try the same workaround to crack into theirs. Find something? Missed him. Mother used this fabric to keep her child warm. They were on the run from something. Stim crate. Should be here. Wait, can you carry more? Thanks, BD1. Appreciate it.
Hey now. What do we find? Go. I'll lead them away. Oster, no! It's all lies. The Empire just wanted this land. Barracks now that the archaeologists are gone. Right. 